What up, what up, everybody? It's your boy, Jordan. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for me real quick. So today, I'll be reacting to the video titled, Worst Effort Plays in U.S. Sports Compilation. This should be funny. This should be funny. So let's get right to it then. Let's go. And Stammen stays from the stretch. And out of it okay, that was a good hit. Oh, Nigel is he going to catch it? Going to catch it? Oh. Bro, get the ball. Bro, oh, bro, get the ball. Wow. 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 Dude. Wait, let me go back. Let me go back. Dude just hit the ball, right? Okay, it was already somebody at third right here. I think that red spot means somebody at third, right? I'll watch baseball like that. Baseball people, y'all can correct me in the comments, all right? So, he's already at third. He's going to score regardless because he dropped the ball. Anyway, and the guy hit it, so he's going to go. At, at, since you dropped the ball, at best you could do is probably stop him at second base. That's probably the best you could do. But this guy, literally, he dropped the ball. He had a whole temper tantrum right in the middle of the play. Like, dude, you could still could have stopped him. I, and, he did a, and he did a whole, like, in-park home run. Come on, man. Oh, yeah, get that. <laughs> He had a whole temper tantrum. Yep, he had an inside park home run. Yep. That was a good play, though. That was a good play. And the Orioles now have a <laughs> he pissed. <laughs> he pissed. Juan Samuel read it all the way, never hesitated to send it. And Nigel Morgan upset at not catching it instead of going after the ball. Right. May have cost his team a run. Number five, James Harden's defense. Sit back and watch this glorious montage. Bro, James. <laughs> oh, oh, James. Come on, James. You better, you better than that. Oh, my God. <laughs> hey, he oh, probably didn't man. see him. No, he's back on D. He's just going to stop him. <laughs> Come No, nah, knock it off. Knock it off. Bro, okay. Let me defend James Harden. Let me defend him. Let me defend him. When he was on the Rockets, he had to get basically 35, 40 every night. I understand. He don't want to play as hard as on defense. He don't play like that now. He don't play like that now. Let me defend him. I got to defend him. He don't play like that now. I understand. Like, he at least could have showed a little more effort. But I understand. He had to get 35, 40 points a night. He didn't He didn't want to put all his all on a defensive end. I understand that. I understand that. So, let me defend James Harden real quick. This is hilarious, though. <laughs> oh, man. Knock it off. Come on. No, oh. it's, no, no. It can't be more. A little porter. Oh, oh. gosh. Yeah, it's your fault. Raise your hand. Oh, man. Man. Here oh, James. Oh, my gosh. Oh, he missed the layup. Oh, no. oh my God. Vic. Oh, yeah, Vic. Keeping the play alive. They find someone in the back. Wait, they talking about 92 then? Like him just staying on the ground? Oh, yeah. They, yeah, okay. I was right there. They are talking about 92. Yeah. Dang. When you go back and watch Albert Hainsworth on that. Yeah, I was just going to say. Yeah. You, know, you got to get up off. He should have shown more effort. Now, he wasn't. Now, if he got up, he wasn't going to get Michael Vick. But I understand. Like, they do, they wanted him to show effort, though. But, you know, just take a look at it yourself. You know, and I realize it's a tough night and it's a rainy night. But you're down on the ground. You have to get up. Yeah, you have, have to, yeah, you have to get up for that. Yeah, I understand. Now nah, he wouldn't got him though. For Cincinnati. Lots of time for Roethlisberger to check down the bell. Almost always a good. Oh wow. Does he go out of bounds? No whistle. Wow. He catches the ball. He comes out of his. What is that? Why? Why? Why did 22 stop? He is in bounds. And what kind of a tackle is that by Jordan Evans? Not good. Back up. Because. 50 pushed him, then 22 just let him just get past. Cliff Lee, first pitch swinging. Easy grounder to fill. <laughs> didn't even run. And he is getting booed. Oh, man, is he even a run? He made a weird gesture as well. He didn't leave. He just kind of shook it off. Check it out. He was starting to run, and he knew Phillips was getting He said, nah, I'm good. Uh, <laughs> right. Exactly. Oh man, that's hilarious. Rushing four ball comes oh. out of hands. Oh yeah, Cap, I, I don't know what he was thinking during that. And still on the ground, picked up by TJ Ward at the four-yard line. Yeah, I don't know what Cam was thinking right there. 
I still don't know to this day. Cam Newton decides not to dive in there. I don't know if he would didn't want to risk getting hurt. I don't know if he wanted a pile to go on him. I don't know. Because you see the pile, I don't know. I, yeah, I don't know what Cam was thinking right there. He probably wouldn't have hurt himself. Like, if it was just one-on-one -on -one with him and the guy getting the ball, okay. But I don't know if Cam was thinking about he might get piled on top on. He had to stay healthy. It was still a one-possession game. But I would have dove for the ball. That probably was Cam was thinking. I don't know. I don't know. Y'all could discuss that in the comments. Ajayi back in the game after the penalty is a first down at 20. Wildcat formation now. Check this out. <laughs> He's chilling. Yeah, Jay straight. Cutler. He's, I'm not even going to try that. <laughs> Cutler said, you got me messed up thinking I'm running around. <laughs> I feel him, though. I feel him, though. I'm not even going to play that either, though. Not even going to lie. Not even going to lie. Caro in there. And there's a Good hit. hit. Dude, jogging? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Dude, chill. <laughs> he, right. He jogged. He said, all right. I get it. Hey, ain't nothing. No big worry. The Rays came back off the field after the top half of the fifth inning. Longoria took exception to BJ up to the lack of effort in Hey, Longoria, I think that was his name they said, right? That, it was no problem what he did. I would have said something, too. I, I would have I would have said something, too. Like, dude, you can't be jogging to get the ball. You have to. I, I, I have no problem with giving accountability for your teammates, especially competition. You, you trying to win games. I understand that completely. Center field. Now, Upton, wait. Now, Longoria, I don't know if he was saying something about Upton Hart or, like, his heart for the game. I don't know. Because if he got that mad or he cut him out, I, I don't know. I didn't know what he said with the words. And you can't blame Longoria for that. Listen, uh, I would rather see teammates get on teammates for talking about what you and I just talked about because right. it looked like BJ was, was jogging after that ball in the gap. Right. Back in the game. All right, Bane Manning. Throwing over the middle. Nice catch. Yeah, that was a nice catch. Oh, y'all ain't going to hit him? Harrison doesn't feel he's been touched on his way to the end zone. <laughs> right. Touchdown. I was going to say, nobody going to touch him. Just going to leave him there. That was a great catch, though. I'm not even going to lie. That was an excellent catch. What a mental gap that is by the Broncos. Yeah, that was bad. The Broncos are going to argue about who has who on this pass. Yeah, that was a great Harris catch, though. That was a nice catch. It. Is he touched? Right. Y'all got a touch, man. He is not. You can see the Broncos are all talking to each other. Good easy touchdown. Very alert. If you don't hear the whistle, keep playing. Oh, yeah. Before we go on, shout out to Peyton Manning and Marvin Harrison, one of the best quarterback wide receiver duos in NFL history. Okay, now we can go. Oh yeah, Marcus Smart. Oh yeah. Wide open. Oh wow. Wide open. Oh come on, Marcus. Oh, and they ain't gonna get the rebound. Come on, come on. That the Suns. Horford will try. Oh come on, yeah. Yeah. Wait, y'all saw D Book at the year. Y'all saw D Book. D Book didn't like D Book was pissed. <laughs> Wait, what up? Let me see. Well, um, let's see. Right here, look at him. Yeah, he pissed. <laughs> oh, yeah. The GOAT LeBron. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Nobody back. I was looking at LeBron the whole time. Man's did not run. <laughs> this has to be 2018. <laughs> you just got to... The same thing when I said this had to be 2018 because Cleveland was the fourth seed. I was going to say, what Le Le oh my God. I was going to say the same thing with LeBron, like I said, with James Harden. They will, they had to be carrying them teams. They're like, I am not wasting all this energy on defense, and I got to score 50, 40 points every night. I feel them. I would have ran back, though. I probably would have I probably would have showed more effort, like LeBron doing the chase down blocks. I'm not saying do that, but at least make it look like you at least trying to play. At least. He's still the goat. <laughs> he said, nah, I'm straight. <laughs> Where are the Cavaliers? Yeah, that was terrible transition defense. Turns into a wide open jumper. Yeah, LeBron said, I'm good. Yeah, they can get that they can get that bucket. That's true. That's poor effort by James and Bonzanovic. High hanging spiraling punt touchback. Barnhart could not pull it up short of the end zone. 
I think the way the returns <laughs> have been going in this game Whoa. Is soon. Wait a minute. What's going on out here? Oh, wait. They down the ball. This is going to be a touchdown. It has a touchdown. Wow. That, that, that is one of the most unbelievable plays I've ever seen. They never down the ball. Hey. Y'all football players, if y'all don't hear that whistle, keep playing. Wow. Was sitting in the end zone, and the Rams picked it up and scored. That ball didn't go out, my man. That ball did not go out. No, oh, no. <laughs> the PA man says apparently it's a touchdown for the Rams. Yep. I mean, you had Bailey picked it up and ran it the entire length of the field. You had guys coming on the field, off the field. Everybody's looking around and nobody can believe it. <laughs> football by Bailey, I guarantee you, he was the only one on the field that knew what was going on. Bailey's 28. Look at the bounce. That's it's a rare bounce. I mean, nobody, All right, that is a rare bounce. And it, watch. Look at this. Nobody is even looking at him. Barnhart's walking off. He thought that was a touchback. Nah. Did you see the officials going by? They were the only ones with him, maybe a couple Rams. Right. You got to play. If you don't hear that whistle, you got to keep playing. So that was the end of that video. That video, like y'all, any like I said with the football players, you got to play past the whistle. It always show effort. Wherever sport you're doing, always show effort, even in life. Whatever you're trying to do with your life, always put in the best you can do. Like if you piss like this baseball player, the very first one, you got to keep playing. You got to keep playing. Just just catch the ball next. Just catch the baseball next time. This video, yeah. This, I learned a lot from this video. Even though it was just showing, like, where it's effort plays. It, I learned, like, always show effort 24-7. That's what I get for it. That's what I get for it. So if y'all enjoyed the video today, go ahead and like, comment, subscribe. Also hit that bell to get all notifications. Also share this video with your friends and family. Follow Jhim Sports on Instagram at J underscore hymns underscore sports and i hope everyone have a blessed day we out